Welcome to Chef Patti and my creamy guacamole for everyone and anyone who's on the rock. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to peel two large avocados or three small ones. Now, when you remove the pit from the avocado, don't throw it out because we're going to use it to keep our avocado from turning brown. And it works amazingly well. You just leave it out and then place it into your guac and it's going to be perfect for at least two or three days. Do not worry if your avocado has some brown parts. Peel them off and that's it. A lot of your avocados, when you buy them whole, will bring parts that are brown. And that is no problem. Now we remove all of our avocado, peel them well, and place them in your food processor. Do not worry if you fill up your food processor because this is semi-solid and it's not going to run out of your food processor. Now we're going to add three limes and you know there are different kinds of limes. So it's about a teaspoon per lime if it's lime like these that are key limes. If you're using the large lime, you might use one or one and a half limes. I'd rather use these key limes because they're the ones that are native from where I live here in the Caribbean. And add the juice with a juicer. Here's a tip. Do not try the juice too strongly. Just go for the first time and leave it like that. This is going to make your creamy guacamole very soft. So just press your lime enough that the lime juice comes out. But do not overpress it because some of the oils are going to come out and it's going to become strong. That's when some people think it's got too much lime juice and it might not be too much lime juice, it might just be you pressed it out too hard. So after we have our lime juice, we go ahead add some cilantro. And for two large avocados or three small avocados, I use three quarter cups of cilantro, add a pinch of salt and pepper, and just go ahead, turn on your food processor, and enjoy an amazing and delicious guac that can be made in minutes. If you have guests, just go buy a couple of avocados, two or three limes, and some cilantro. You are done. In less than two minutes, while people say hi or have a drink, you're done and ready is delicious and creamy guacamole. You can also make it ahead of time and store it, like I told you, with the pits. The pits and just place them inside your wok cover and forget it. It's going to be perfect, beautiful and green when you're good, whenever you're ready to eat your guacamole. Remember, with Chepachi, delicious diets are sustainable diets. Enjoy your creamy guacamole. Chepachi. Scroll down for the recipe. You can print it.